a roller coaster game, especially after last night. How fitting is it that you win in walk-off fashion in extra innings? Well, it was. It, there's no doubt it was a, a seesaw game, and it was, you know, we went up, they went up, back and forth. And uh, after the, the last couple games we've had in Kansas City, it was, uh, I think, a huge lift, uh, not just to get the win, but to, to get the win the way we did. Justin Upton, phenomenal tonight as well as in the month of June. What's been the key for his success at the plate? He's a streaky hitter. And he, he's always been a streaky hitter, and uh, he's got off to a rough start, but I think he's, he's making up for some lost time. He's got, he's got big powers he showed with the home run center field. And uh, quite frankly, I, think, I hope he stays hot through September. With J.D. Martinez on the DL, how significant is it that he's heating up and so hot right now? It, it'll be very important. If he, if he can stay hot and... Uh, and continue to contribute offensively. That, that certainly, you know, we'd rather have JD here, but that certainly uh, helps minimize the, the damage. Hey, Brad, you got to love the job your bullpen did, obviously. I mean, Wilson gives up the one run, but this is a pen that's obviously been taxed, and they were good today. It was. We, it, it, uh, you know, Willie, he did give up the run, un, un, unfortunately, but then Kay, from that point on, we were, we were smooth and clean all the way through. Uh, got out of some tight situations with both Willie, uh, Alex Wilson, and, uh, and Sanchi. Um, but ultimately, they, they held them where, the, the, where the, we needed to hold them until we could score a run. When a guy like Justin Wilson struggles like he has, and then, I'm sorry, Justin Upton, and, and then he has the game like he has, and she talked about the June, like his Tiger moment, do you kind of feel like, like the, the, obviously, how do you think that feels for I, a guy like I that? mean, I'm sure he feels a lot better about himself. I mean, he was beating himself up a little bit. He wants to contribute to his new team. Um, and quite frankly, I hope this is the, where he launches. Uh, I, think, I hope he looks back at the end of the season and said, this is where I really became a Tiger, and this is where the season really took off for not only him, but for the whole team. Kyle Ryan tonight looked more comfortable against lefties. How much of that did he work on in the minors? Well, that was the whole reason he went to the minors. It was to, to improve his approach at getting lefties out, uh, using a sinker on both sides, especially in the lefties, and, and getting a more consistent breaking ball. You see Pelfrey tonight pitching only five innings. What did you see from him, and does he need to find a pitch to get lefties out, or does he just need to have better command? Well, he, it was a, definitely a struggle for him. He wasn't as sharp as he can be. Um, somehow he muddled through and, uh, and still kept us in the game, so I give him credit for that. Uh, he has done a better job of using his breaking balls. Lefties have always kind of been a, a problem for him, but uh, he's done a better job of using his breaking balls as opposed to just his two-seamer and his split, so uh, that has helped. But tonight, he just wasn't as sharp as he has been his last few starts. Can you tell me your reaction when you saw that Miguel Cabrera homer that gave you guys a 2-0 lead? Uh, I, I knew it was gone. So I, don't, I didn't really, <laughs> I, didn't really uh, I don't know if I did, did said anything, but it, I knew it was gone as soon as he hit it. How reliable is he to get the offense sparked? Miggy, well, I mean, he's the guy that I think everyone kind of looks to. Um, uh, you know, he's got he's got a bookshelf of trophies, and uh, a lot of the guys uh, look at him as kind of uh, the offensive player on the team and one of the best offensive players in the history of the game. So it's a uh, it's a little bit of weight to carry, but he's he's done it for you know 11, 12 years now, and. Uh, Tonight was just another example of how much power he has. Three, um, I think three inning ending double plays for you guys. Talk about the significance of your defense keeping able to keep Pelfrey in there tonight. Well, that's part of what Pelfrey does. Is he gets ground balls. So despite the fact that he gets base runners, sometimes he's able to wiggle out of trouble, and he did that a number of times tonight. What does the uh, the win tonight say about the perseverance of your ball club? We keep going. You got uh, We didn't we didn't really like the road trip, especially the way it ended. Uh, but we played better at home here recently, and we're back home for a, a long stretch. So we're hoping to continue to play like we did tonight, but maybe in nine innings. All right. Thanks, Brad.